All right, let's take a helicopter and use its powerful gun and missiles to see what kind of damage we can do to the general's blockade on the bridge. Shooting out the supports will result in the bridge destroying in different ways every time. We wanted to make this fun and creative, so come up with as many different ways to use this huge piece of destruction to your advantage. With the bridge out of commission, Rico can focus on the next objective. And to make that a little easier, we've instituted a new Rebel Drop system. The Rebel Drop system allows Rico to order weapons and vehicles at a moment's notice via airdrop. And it gives you yet another tool to pull off that crazy idea. This beautiful and peaceful flight offers us another opportunity to show off a new feature, and that's our new stunting system. So we moved away from the specific authored points on vehicles from JC2 and allowed the player total freedom on top. So if you jump out onto the plane, you can actually walk around the plane wings themselves. And of course, the plane itself can be used as a means of destruction. Maybe we should get off the plane first. Let's swap out wings for wheels and take a motorbike for the remainder of our journey. And while it's nice to weave along Medici's roads with the wind in our face, it is inevitable that Diravello's men will catch up. We can do combat directly from the bike, and eventually defeating Diravello's military. And here we are at another of the General's huge military facilities, and it's time for another choice how you'd like the destruction to unfold.